Welcome to Guyana. Let's get into this part of the video really quickly. This is our lovely bathroom. Very simple, a very hotel like. If you know a hotel, you know a hotel bathroom. It's giving everything that a hotel bathroom gives. And that's me. <laughs> then there is the closet with, of course, your typical ironing board and iron and hangers. And then I didn't take a look in this one. Oh, you have extra drawers on the pillow. That's nice. Then you have your coffee station. Coffee and tea station, I should say. And then, of course, you have your bedroom. I got the king bed. You know, guys, I love a double. But I have an amazing view. So I will take it any day. We have our TV, our desk, our complimentary water. Mini fridge, most likely, is under here, yes. And just extra storage spaces here. I'm gonna meet one of my crew members downstairs, so I'm trying to hurry up, but still get you all the information that you need. And of course, our lovely bed. You guys know how I feel about these beds that are like side tables and lights incorporated. I think it's so smart and i'm definitely gonna do that from my room in jamaica i just love how it looks and then in the morning i will show you the view but for now you can see the pool and me but we do have a pool view and a sea view room you just can't see the sea right now so in the a.m stay tuned for that guys i'm gonna get changed and go down to the pool and meet one of my crew members before i get too comfortable and I do this all the time. I'm going to peel up, make sure underneath and everything is looking all right. From my view, I can already see one of my crew members waiting on me. So let us go. And if you're from Guyana, please, I beg you, drop a comment down below. Let me know where your favorite spots, um, especially all across the island, not just Georgetown. You know, being reasonable and all, until I get to pick up another Guyana trip, I more likely will just be in the Georgetown touristy areas. So when I get to pick up another trip, let me know where you guys like to go and i will try to venture out more the next time but since i'm here for the first time i just like a stay in the area i'm a kind of kind of know and link up with some people um if you've responded to my instagram stories you know giving me suggestions and i didn't get to go to them don't fret i will get to go to them eventually i'm just trying to you know get where i can get know for a fact that i'm gonna try out the kc because i've already been stirring up conversations with some of the local people here and obviously guyana is their favorite place to get kc so we're gonna we're gonna really see about that so if you want to fuel in and jump in with the kc competition drop down below where you think has the best kc which island, whether it be Jamaica, Trinidad, Guyana, Barbados, um, whether it be Japan, America, the UK, Barcelona, let me know where you think has the best KFC and let's see who can win in the comment section, all right? Drop a flag, drop a KFC and a location, just represent your country, represent wherever you love KFC the most and we'll, we'll really see. Because every time I get to go to these places, I'm going to try out the KFC. So next time I get to go to Barcelona, wait for the KFC video, okay? But tomorrow, we on KFC. Thank you. All right. Um, let me go down to the pool. So see you guys down there. I'm really a fan of this hairstyle. I mean, granted, it's just a... Why is this not coming? 
it's just that like an updo with some pieces. Give me a second. It's just like an updo with some pieces left out, but I'm feeling it. And my swimsuit. This is from Shein. And my shorts are from Air Postel. My bag is from J. Crew. And my shoes, you probably can't really see it that well, yeah. is from Tory Burch. So that really is the fit for tonight. If you see the fit again, I need to figure out how this works. If you see the fit again, just know we'll wash your clothes and we're going to wear your clothes because we're people clothes. So nobody can tell you nothing. Um, that's just getting That's just getting it. I can't say nothing. Oh, 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 my lips so loud. You're perfect, bitch. You thought I could be loud. But, uh, you just been around the club. But you in LA, and I'm out of Jamaica. See you guys in the morning. Good night. Good morning, B Squad. It is literally 12 p.m. We went to bed around 5 a.m. We stayed in the pool dancing, doing a bunch of dance routines, child. We were backup dancers. We were backup singers. <laughs> we were just enjoying ourselves. So now I'm all dressed and ready to go try KFC. So I need to look up where the closest KFC is. I think they said I can walk to a KFC. That is what I'm feeling like eating. Actually, I'm going to eat some of my yogurt because... Child, I'm gonna drop down before I reach the KFC. So, I'm gonna eat some yogurt um, and then we're gonna walk. Of course, I'm in my Jamaica shirt. It took everything out of me to not, to try to not wear the shirt, okay? I was telling myself, don't do it. Don't do it. But I did it. So, they need to know where your girl is from. They need to know that when I bite into the KFC, I'm just kidding. I'm gonna try my best. To be as unbiased as possible um the beach is right in front of us uh well in front of me right now but the water is brown it's not giving beach unfortunately i don't know if any of you guys are from guyana i've said it before but please if you can explain to me why that is um i looked on the map and i tried to look at the outline of like you know on the map I, I think i'm trying to screenshot it and put it in here but along the whole outline of this the beach the coast it was brown on the map so that kind of shocked me i couldn't really find anywhere that had blue waters for a beach so please explain to me or i'll even look up myself why that is so the beach won't be something i'll be going in but i'm gonna try my best to capture some drone shots we are pretty far from the airport. I shouldn't have any problems taking off the drone. I'm just so excited. I'm in Guyana. That is so amazing. Hopefully, you know, in the future, I can come back for a longer period of time and go and check out the waterfall. Um, Guyana has, I believe it's the longest, like highest, like single drop waterfall in the world if not the world the northern the western hemisphere so that would be very excited we have a passenger on the plane he was here for business but he said he was going to go check it out before he leaves so hopefully i can come back as well and check that out because that is a world wonder if i may say so myself like the highest waterfall in the world come on come on that is really cool so Anyways, enough of me chatting. Let me eat some breakfast and let's go get some KFC. I'm out by the pool. I'm waiting on one of my crew members. We're going to head to um, KFC together. So, ouch. She's like to give her 20 minutes. I'm going to set up my drone. I can get the nice shot them. I ate 
the Greek yogurt. Uh, I did put some fruits in mine. And guys, I don't know if that was the best decision. Because all of yesterday, I definitely like used ice and dry ice to keep it refrigerated in my lunch kit. I um, don't know. I don't want to call nothing down. So let me knock on this piece of, piece of straw and hope that there's some wood in it. Because I don't know if that was the best decision. <laughs> um, I just hope so, you know. I haven't flown my drone in so long. And... I want to get a nice drone shot of the area so yeah I also got some money so let me show you I got I took out four thousand dollars four thousand Guyanese which is 23 US dollars um, and I got them in thousand dollar notes and this is what it looks like it's really pretty They have the outline, where is it? Right here, the outline of Guyana on the note. Really, really pretty, and I don't know, this is the bank of Guyana, okay. Nice. I don't know if they're all the same. Looks like all the thousand dollar bills are the same. You know, the Jamaica money have the national heroes on it. I don't know if the different notes have different things, so when I get changed, I will show you guys. But in the meantime, between time, let me set up my drone. And when I get it up there, I'm gonna insert the drone shot so y'all can see. And when my crew member gets here, I'll come back to you guys. Bye. For another day, Nah, the day, nah, the child, you have to give thanks to life, man, I move forward, me not to laugh, watch it, dog. I went to go fly the drone, turn on the drone, connect everything, dead battery. Dead. The drone is dead. So I'm just waiting for it to charge at the bar, and in the meantime, between time, I'm just checking out some YouTube videos um, when I looked at the map it didn't look like there was any restrictions in um, the airspace at least where I'm where I'm at so I should be able to take off the drone no problem and uh, fly it a little bit even the town like right on the other side of the hotel is a town so that's even more perfect because then we can get the river shot the ocean shot and the town shot not having to go very far at all which is really nice so yeah i've been i've been listening to um their accent trying to figure out what i can understand and yeah not bad um sounds very much like trinidad very similar to Bayesian as well, like a mix between Trinidad and Bayesian accent. And I'm, I mean, that's what I'm hearing. Okay, don't come for me if that's not what you hear. That's just what I hear. My crew member texted me. All right, let me go see how much the drone charges up because we gotta get to walking. It is 12:35, and we want to enjoy the day, right? the town being very careful with my devices I've been warned a couple times but you guys know me you know me already so people are not gonna try me you know me but yes my crew member is actually shocked that there's no sidewalks but I'm like this is very normal this is very normal for, for um, our type of countries 
Guys, the men here are doing what men do in the Caribbean. Annoy women. <laughs> <laughs> the amount of kiss, kiss noise and the amount of beep, beep, beep. And the amount of, oh, you're beautiful. And it's like, guys, this reminds me of downtown. Um, downtown Kingston. The same. The exact same. Or even like Spanish town, in other town. The exact same. The same type of mannequins set up with the clothes. The same wholesale supermarket. I even saw a singer. The same. So if you ever want to travel to Ghana and you're from Jamaica, not no much different. <laughs> but yeah, at least it's not rich. The um it's not rich the KFC. Hi, afternoon. Um, can I have a two piece meal and a three piece? A two piece and a three piece meal? Yeah. 3260. And can I buy one of the, um, uh, you have cream soda? Yeah. Both cream soda? One Pepsi, one cream soda. Alright, so I've never seen this drink before. It's called Soka. And you, which flavor are you? Oh, yeah. The slice, orange. And I have cream soda. And it's a product of Guyana. Um, so let's try it. Oh. Make sure you guys are liking up the videos and everything and commenting, representing who has the best KFC. So I ordered one to bring home and one to eat. I want mommy to try it out. Let me keep my opinion to myself so I can try it. There's honey. She said she don't have no honey. Alright, anyways, I had ordered a three piece and a, a two piece for myself. I'm gonna ask the leg and tie. Alright, let me switch. Give me a minute, let me switch these around. So, this is what my meal is looking like. Like I said, I got the two piece. I got my drumstick and a thigh. Got some fries. And a biscuit. Let's try it out. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Moment of truth. Mm. It's not bad. Yeah, it's not bad. I like it. Is, is it, it better than that? No. <laughs> Listen, I'm trying to be nice. No, I do like it. It tastes really good. But Jamaica is still number one. I'm so sorry. Argue with yourself. Jamaica is still number one. It is better than America. <laughs> And one thing I can also say from experience is that the line, same way, the line were long, but compared to Jamaica, the people are much, much more patient. So that's nice. Nobody was cussing or arguing with the um, employees, if I like that. But it did take a long time. Walking back to the hotel. Overall, I would rate the food courts. <laughs> it's like them all over the Caribbean. 
Sound rate, the KSC. Uh, I'd give it a 5 out of 10. I'd give it a 5. Don't hate me if you're from Guyana, but I'll give it a 5. You want to walk down the middle of this? Um, it wasn't bad, like at all. Yes. <laughs> a 5. I would say at least like a 7. You'd be a 7? Okay. Only because they didn't have like mashed potatoes. Ah. Okay. You know what? When you try some of the other places, you see. But well, guys, let me know where your favorite KC is. Just drop a comment and let your girl know. But either way, we're walking back to the hotel and we're taking the scenic route compared to the route we took earlier. So I hope you enjoy and I'll see you in a minute. Guys, I'm out by the pool. I'm going to take some pictures for my thumbnail. And um, we got complimentary bears. This one is a bear from Guyana, from Georgetown. Um, yeah, it's called Banks. Brewery Fresh Banks Caribbean Lager. So if you know this bear, I'm gonna get a better um, shot. In fact, I'm gonna I'm gonna drop a picture of the bear. But if you know this bear, guys, let your girl know. I liked I like the way it tastes. This is probably one of the best tasting bears I've ever tasted, to be honest. Yeah, man, it's a very nice bear. All right, I'm gonna take pictures and I'm gonna lay out and enjoy the sun. The sun was sunning today because I feel so tired you wouldn't even understand I'll see you guys when I get to the room guys mm, like I said the sun was sunning I'm going to put away my stuff because I'm not doing anything for the rest of the night I did meet this lovely lady, so if any of you are from Guyana and want to do your hair, let me try and get this card up as close as possible. She does hair. Oh, it's not focusing the best. Let me turn on this light. Um. Yeah, you can find her at Butterfly Shoddy. Butterfly Shoddy on Facebook. Hair by Butterfly Shorty. See it here. I'm really trying. It's it's just not. It's too dark. The colors aren't gonna pop up. But yeah, she was like, "Oh, do your hair." I'm like, "I'm not here for long enough to do all that, but I do appreciate it. Do appreciate it a lot." Anywho, I have the KFC for mommy. And let me explain why I give it a five, okay? Don't even think like Jamaica is not a 10 out of 10. Jamaica is not a 10 out of 10 and America is one. So imagine, I give Jamaica a 8.5 out of 10. Various reasons, customer service, the time you order your food to the time you get your food, the way it tastes, presentation. I have my reasonings on why girl yeah so this is the, the chain jamaica being amazing my my favorite is an 8.5 right 8.5 and guyana is a five i rate it as a five personal opinions and america is a one is a one so take take it how you want to take it but that's just what i think I'm gonna bring this back for mommy, so I'm gonna wrap it up in here. Put it in my suitcase, you know. Traveling, and pack up everything else. I did get invited to a party from a driver that was recommended to me, um, but I'm not, not. Nah. I, I have to get up early. I have to get up at what, like 4 a.m. or something like that. Not even, yeah, like 3.30 is when I have to get up in the morning. I'm not going to go out. I want to lay down 
watch my movies enjoy myself i have some money which i'm gonna save i don't i didn't get no coins let me see what the smallest note is this twenty dollars i'm gonna save this twenty dollars and i'm gonna go buy some food so this is what the twenty dollars and i did say i was gonna show you guys this is what the twenty dollars is looking like this is what it's looking like this is what the hundred dollars is looking like. Because before I showed you a thousand. So that's cool. I have two hundred and forty dollars to my name in Guyana right now. Um, so I may walk outside and grab a food at that food truck. And... If anything, I'll just keep it with me until I come back to Guyana. How about that? You know what? Stop to spend money because you have money. I'm going to keep it with me. Next time I come back to Guyana, I at least have a little money in my bag. Is it? Alright. When I get all settled, I'll come back to you guys. And I hope you like, comment, and subscribe. And yeah. See ya. Good morning. <laughs> Which is amazing you already know why <laughs> and then we have a mirror thank you and then we also have TVs my uniform is set up for tomorrow to get iron and of course the star of our show the balcony so it's not like the bestest of views but it's really not bad either we do have our chairs and our table and our amazing Miami view, which is still raining in Miami. Um, you can't really see it, but it is drizzling. So we're going to go grab some food and come back to the hotel. And because of the canceled flight, we are, I am, and my crew aren't working our flights tomorrow. We'll just be deadheading, going back to New York as passengers. I got Chad on the next flight, which would be the 6.59 flight so unfortunately we're gonna have to wake up super early to get tried to the airport so we can't stay out and do anything crazy you know <laughs> so i will see you guys later Bye. i like the video the guy on a vlog i'm not sure how long the vlog is if i can throw in a couple more days i will do that but if i can't thank you guys so much for watching and this would be the end if it's not the end you already know because you see all the minutes but thank you so much for watching i really appreciate you if you're from guyana big up yourself your uh country reminds me so much of jamaica um especially with the way the men act and just with the way everything was set up and you know just the culture so big up on yourself make sure you like comment share and subscribe and stay tuned for the other vlogs yeah, she said she loved